Hi guys, in the last video you saw how we picked up our truck in Wörth am Rhein at Mercedes. And in this video you're gonna see how we change everything on the chassis in order to prepare it for the cabin, which is gonna be on the back. And uh, yeah, there are some changes to do. Uh, we do those at uh, Mercedes Wiedmann in Fohn Strauss. Thank you for that. You see also our adaption to the second alternator. We decided for a second alternator instead of a generator. And uh, yeah, so enjoy this lovely video. And oh yeah, we have some news. Of course, it's not news to us anymore. We're gonna announce the cabin builder who is gonna do the whole expedition vehicle. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. In the end of this video, we're gonna tell you. So enjoy the video. I am Isabella and I am from Brazil. This is Fabian and he is German. We've been overlanding the world with our home sweet home, Frank the Tank, for the past almost four years. And together with our son Matteo and our two lovely dogs, Uni from Spain and Basco from Germany, we are living even for before. Subscribe and welcome to the family. Da wo der jetzt ist, ist meine Tür. Es gibt, da ist mein Türkasten. Wo baut ihr das hin? Das schaut ihr dann. Das, da ist auf jeden Fall Platz drin, oder? Ja. Der, ja. Kommt, der kommt ja komplett weg, kommt der, der Tank hin, wo, denke ich, hier, wo ich die habe. Genau. Und das hier gerade Schützventil wird einfach nach innen versetzt. Und die da auch. Electronic Air Pressure Unit. Electronic Air Pressure Unit, jawohl. Haben wir die trennen voneinander? Natürlich. Ah, okay. Die können wir trennen, die beiden Luftkirchen-Einheiten. Ja. Und dann können sie halt dementsprechend diese Einheit mit auf hier hinsetzen und diese Einheit nach hinten. Es werden dann halt verbunden mit sogenannten Kunststoffschläuchen hier. Werden die miteinander verbunden, so wie sie jetzt verbunden sind. Ja. Werden sie halt verbunden und im Raum halt dementsprechend gehen. Good morning, guys. Guten Morgen. I'm not sure if you see this in German, English. We have subtitles. But anyways, good news. Um, you see me still driving, this time alone. Isabella and Matteo, I left them at home. It's really early next morning from Mercedes. Yesterday you saw, or you saw in one of those videos, how we picked up our truck. Yes, now it's my first ride alone to test a little and in daylight, a little bit more daylight than yesterday. We arrived really late. I'm gonna go to Auto Haus Wiedmann. Um, they are so nice to yeah, change a few things, preparation on the chassis. We're gonna change the tank uh, size. It's gonna be a bigger one. In some videos I showed already that we ordered the tank. And uh, we're gonna put some stuff that's outside of the chassis. We gotta put it inside the frame. That wasn't possible, or let's say it is a little better if Autohaus Wiedmann does it. Woohoo, hi guys. So now we are here with our brand new Arox and Florian from Autohaus Wiedmann is already disconnecting it. It's nothing bad. It's just because we're gonna switch tanks. We get a bigger tank. So we film it a little without annoying Florian, hopefully. <laughs> Ja. Vorlauf, Rücklauf für Motor. Sensor. Und das ist Belüftung, Tankbelüftung. Mit ah. Filter. Da okay. waren die ersten Vorzeichen, haben keinen Filter gehabt und da haben wir Injektorprobleme. Ah, okay. Durch Salz, durch Streusalz ist das gewesen und das Streusalz ist, das ist filtergängig. Okay. Jetzt haben wir den Filter dafür einbaut und seitdem haben die Probleme mit Injektor. Muss ich den irgendwann warten oder ist das? Ja, dann Okay, cool. Cool. 
In order to switch the tanks out, which uh, Florian already took care of, uh, we need to move all the parts that are on the frame. The problem is not removing it, the problem or you know is where we're gonna put him in the inside so Florian is thinking a lot and disconnecting all the pieces and uh, yeah we'll hopefully find all the spots inside the frame in order to fix the big tank on the side and obviously when we have the cabin there we also want the space on the side for storage boxes mm -hmm. stay tuned when I talked about the big tanks I'm talking about those three the small one isn't an issue, but the two bigger ones might be space-wise. Let's see. Okay. In order to move everything around, we need to take away the spare tire. And uh, yeah, we found spots and you will see the final result. guys 24 hours later we are driving back my dad and me to pick up my truck I hope they switched the tank the tanks everything from the frame is now clean and is ready to go to the cabin builder so stay tuned uh, in about 20 minutes we're gonna pick it up again and again thanks to Auto House Wiedmann for a wonderful job whoever out there who need something like this they are excellent guys so let's hope they do a good great job check it out look at this look at this system nice system check it out here's our new tank wow this is new on a new position check it out this is totally new those tanks were outside. Ah, geil. Komm ich da hier von unten? Den muss ich nicht wechseln, oder? Äh, hinlegen mit diesem komischen Spezialgerät, oder? This is on a new position, oh my god. Und das da, oder? Krass. Wow. And now here Florian is, nah, he's changing, you're changing the tank size, right? In the system that the feeler uh, feels the right diesel amount. <laughs> Work on it. Sounds good. New tank. New tanks. And here are the tanks from below. Awesome. It's 10 o'clock at night. Thanks to those guys. Everything is done and we are ready to drive to the cabin builder. Dann sage ich mal auf Deutsch, auf Bayerisch auch hier für unseren Kanal einmal vielen Dank. Nichts zu danken. Sau geil. Autohaus Wiedmann. The place to go. Danke. See you when we see you. We have a big surprise for you guys in this video. <laughs> exactly. Everybody or a lot of people are asking who's going to build the cabin on the big rig. Who's going to do that? So, well, <laughs> shall we do it? Shall we say it? We, we do give... 3, 2, 1 and we do together. No, we give you a hint first. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the hint is going to be we're going to drive to Austria next weekend. Yes. That we drop the car, the truck, and then they're going to build the cabin on top. So who is it? Yeah, let's Three, see. two, one. Krug, Krug XP. XP. <laughs> we'll build the back of our truck yes. and we'll put everything together. Why we decided for all that and you know how this happened and any, everything we will tell you later in other videos. But this is the news. Krug XP is gonna put the truck together. We also have news. Mm -hmm. when we get the truck oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> so a little pressure on everybody around us who they're all shaking now uh, no they said on Abenteuer Allrad in Bad Kissingen this is a trade show known for yeah overland vehicles we have never been but this year we might go yeah 
and there in middle of October you maybe can see our truck there too exactly and that's until then they try to be ready yes so thanks for watching thank you guys see you when we see you